Hey everyone, this is Zach, here with another episode of Hope for Master Ball. Today we are going to continue with the Zacian Thunders rain team, and we are making just a bit of a comeback after a really terrible episode, so if you guys enjoyed this content, do not forget to like and subscribe. Hopefully we can have some good matchups today, and today in the comment section down below, I want to know, are you excited for Legends Arceus? It's definitely something new, and something I'm really excited to try. I'm probably going to have a playthrough on the channel because it's going to probably take up a lot of my time when it first comes out. So I'm definitely going to make content on it. But I want to know what you guys think. Uh, what do you expect from the game? Just let's talk about it in the comments down below. But let's hang around until we find our first matchup. And we'll see how it goes. Alright, we got our first one. Romeo. Okay, Moltres. Ensign. Urshifu, Zacian, Colossal. Ooh. 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 Oh, man. How do I how do I do the matchup here? I think I, I definitely need the fake out pressure. Okay, Rillaboomization. So we get a Dumble Intimidate out, which is actually really good. Who do you preserve here? I want to say you preserve the Zacian, but I don't think I can make that risk. I think I can after a max airstream, actually. Withdraw the Rillaboom into the Ensign. Feel like I made the wrong play here. Feel like I made the wrong play. How much does a minus one behemoth blade do to a max lander? So like we have no bulk. I, I'm pretty sure this one's just straight 252, 252. Station is going to protect. Okay. Let's helping hand. I don't think we'll get it off. You could switch into Moltres. I, I want to say you have Moltres in the back. We 
let's bring Insim back in and just max Quake. Moltres? Rillaboom again. Okay. Did you double switch again? No, just a fake out. And it shook a berry, but at this range, like... Now you could just protect here. Yeah, let's just max Quake because we should be faster now. Okay, so you predicted the Politoed switch. And that's great damage. That should one shot. I parring shot the I parting shot the Rillaboom because I was worried about the Zacian protecting. Then I knew if we got the parting shot off, we would be able to. We would be able to get the instant back in and get an Intimidate off on the Zacian anyway. Ooh, do you have close combat or sacred sword? Because I think we might take a sacred sword at this range. Okay, we get a big behemoth blade into the Moltres.
we get the one shot on the Moltres. Let's see, do I want to switch out the Politoed? Well, there's no more grassy terrain. I'm gonna switch out the Zacian here. And just protect the Politoed. I think with this many Intimidates, like, we might actually take, like, a Grassy Glide. We'll have to see if they show Woodhammer. You do max the Rillaboom, but you're minus three or four at this point. But I guess that does break through the Protect. strike that slows us down and that does three damage where's this Rillaboom at minus five I'm going to double into this Asian. Ooh, play rough. Okay. Politoed hangs on. Oh, Ensign's faster though. We get the burn. <laughs> this Rillaboom is not having a day. I think we parting shot here. An incense faster than Politoed, so if we pair song, we'll get Zacian trapped in the pair song. And a G Max Rillaboom just took all three turns of Gigantamax to take out a Politoed. What is a burn minus six Rillabooms attack at this point? Do you protect? 
You should just quit at this point. Playing it out. I respect that. Zacian gets the knockout. We played really well. Hit our board position very decently and just made good calls on the switches. I want to say turn one, uh, going into the Rillaboom, wasn't the best call. We probably could have done a little better there, but getting that speed advantage, knowing that the next turn we outsped the Zacian, let us make uh, a really good, like, really good play. But. Yeah, that was a really good one. And I actually want to... I want to check the damage. That should be enough for Ultra Ball. Yeah. Okay, let's check this out. Okay, so I looked it up, and if that Rillaboom was adamant, max attack, its attack stat was down after the burn and the minus six was down to about 29. That's nothing. Ooh, Minxiao. Um... The fake out does really good. I don't know if this is it. Okay. Okay, okay, okay. We get the Intimidate off on Landers, and we get the Defiant boost. Now I do have to worry about a... I do have to worry about like a like para crap. Oh, well no. You can scary face like if you have scary face, but we'll have to see if you're scary face or T-wave. I think you just get a reflect up. This Landorus is minus 2. Um you should go for max rockfall. Into the Thunderous. Just setting up the Reflect. Okay, you're just getting both screens up. Um... 
Um, let's see. At plus two, we would be 188. So we shall we should be faster than the Landorus. So we'll go ahead and parting shot to make it minus two, and then we'll switch in Landorus to make it minus three. That way, even if they sword stance, like you're still at minus one. Okay. And foul play, that's going to do a lot. I want to get this Landers to plus one for the rock slide. And get this Grimmsnarl out of the way, because foul play. Ugh. And, okay, so we'll be... We'll be minus one. Decent chip. What's this superpower and earthquake? Because if you try to go for Trick Room... Min Chao, okay. Okay, so you just automatically max. Goodness, Diog is so bulky. There's the weakness policy. I was about to say, you have to go into Thunderous. This could be throwing it. And they still have three mons left. Oh.
Yeah, we threw it. I think we're better off trying to hit a Draco Meteor. And Landorus' attack is like nothing. This is a flip from the previous game. What is our lander's hat? Minus four. We could try to go for accuracy drops and muddy water misses, but... Oh, Kingdra's faster? Kingdra goes down. We didn't get an accuracy drop. And just a body press. Good game. We want to protect the fake out. Fake out, probably flash cannon. Roar of time. And we've already seen that their Dialga is faster. Reflect's gone. I jump kick miss into a double crit earthquake. Nope, wide guard. <laughs> um. Good game, yeah. That was fun still. I guess that was a little bit of payback from uh, making Rillaboom minus six. I guess knocking out the Landorus over the Grimmsnarl might have been better there. But then a foul play from Grimmsnarl would have just knocked out. Um... Would have just knocked out. Thunderous. Ooh, so they have their own rain. They don't have Intimidate, though.
Let's see. They should lead Berserker. They should Kingdra. So we could see a Protect Max Geyser. And they would have to... They would have to double into the Thunderous turn one. If they double into the Thunderous turn one, I think Kingdra just sweeps. Did they do it? No protect, did you double? You did double. That or you went into the Landris with Geyser? Okay. Kingdra should be faster. I think we just, uh, like... Okay, so you get the Zacian off the field. Airstream into the Landorus. Landorus goes down. We have to protect here. Did they double? We don't get it. How many more turns of... Ah, oh, well, they still outspeed.
There's two more turns of rain. So they could just protect here. And get the knockout. Yeah. Okay, so at least we went for the Rillaboom. Boom hangs on though, unfortunately. There's a U turn into the Zacian. Okay, instant misses. That does so much damage to Zacian. Behemoth Blade. So we should have protected there. How were we gonna know that was gonna miss? And then Flare Blitz in the rain is gonna do nothing, plus Grassy Grain. Grassy terrain. No, we should have turned one. If we knew for sure that they were going to go into the landers, we could have max airstream and fly. That way the max geyser misses. And the fake out sacred sword just does it here. Yeah. Still, uh, st like with Steely Spirits, like Behemoth Blade will probably get the knockout now. Let's see. I want to know. Cause you're plus. You're basically a plus two. Yeah. Wish I would have saw more of the Berserker. Good game. King of yeah, just not two fifty two on on attack. So there's a little bit more bulk. Assault Vest Rillaboom. Still a Spirits Focus Ash. Okay. Alright. Ups and downs uh, throughout the matches. I feel like the last two, we might have played them a little uh, too aggressive, which caused us to have a bad endgame, especially against the Dialga getting off uh the weakness policy but at that point like i don't think there was much i could have done there 
besides bringing Zacian. I, I think that Kingdra bring uh, match two was a bad idea. And I think not bringing it uh, game three was a bad idea as well. Because I could have I could have protected and Max airstreamed. And so when they set up the rain, or they probably wouldn't have set up the rain at that point. But then we would have been able to outspeed turn two and get a Draco Meteor off into the Kingdra slot. <sighs> Maybe that, like... There's a lot of things I could have done differently. Uh, turn one on that third match. But let me know what you think in the comments down below. And if you made it this far in the video, I do want to say thanks for watching. Do not forget to like and subscribe. Either way, I'm Zach, and we will see everyone later.